valleys. They're known as pilas in Cuba. Again, don't forget to clean the um, bearing edge of the instrument. Get your head sitting well. You can even push it a bit into place and get your hook. <clears throat> the timbales, these uh, particular timbales I'm using, have six lugs, as you can see. So make sure that they sit on top of the uh, of this little bracket. Then you get a washer and uh, a bolt and proceed to put it on a drum. We're gonna be doing this with the six of them. It may be easier for you to also do it um, on a drum by itself without setting it on a, without having it on a stand. For the purpose of the, of the a video this time, I'm just keeping it in there. Okay, now I proceed to get my wrench and start tuning. I'm going half away only for now. The macho or or the male, the high timbal is tuned very very high to my taste and to a lot of the timbal players' taste, like the A A note. And we're quite far from there, so I want to use now my ratchet. As a, as a timbal player, I like to use a real contrast between the high and the low tones. Just the embra can be tuned to a, a D below the A. So what we want to do is um, get our A note. I'm very close to it. happy with the Evans heads and the tuning of the drums and I want to thank you so much for your attention and I hope that you will be very successful in your playing out there and more than anything with your tuning because it's all about music. Thanks a lot.